Hi everyone, my name is Pete Harris from A-Team Group and we're here today to talk about market data from the cloud. Have uh, representatives here from Exignite, from uh, CME Group and from BG Cantor. Uh, and I'm going to start I think with uh, you Stefan from Exignite. Can you just explain a bit, bit about what this concept of market data from the cloud is? Sure. Uh, market data on the cloud or market data on demand, if you want, is just trying to make market data uh, a lot easier to access and consume and bring into uh, client applications, if you want. Uh, historically, accessing market data, consuming market data has required a lot of infrastructure. Uh, you need to get connectivity in place with, with, with sources. Uh, you need you know, network connections for that, you need hardware, you need software, you need to be able to integrate those feeds with your application. So there's a lot of infrastructure you have to put in place, a lot of data management. And often, you know, this is something that makes sense from a business standpoint. Sometimes it's something that's quite expensive. Uh, market data on the cloud is just being able to request the data you need, when you need it, exactly the data that you need, without having to incur the expenses uh, to manage all this infrastructure if you want. So it uses uh, the concept of cloud computing, which is very elastic resources available. So if you need a lot of data, then the system is ready to give that data to you. It uses uh, simple standards to make integration easy, things like XML, for example, or REST. And all of these combine to just make data easy to integrate, it demystifies access to it, it uh, democratizes access to information. Right, so it's broadly about ease of use and reduced costs and, uh, and very accessible uh, wherever you are in the world. Exactly. Okay. So Jonathan Thursby, CME Group, what is an organize, organization like CME Group uh, doing with market data in the cloud? Wh what are you doing and what benefits is that bringing to you and to your clients? You know, I think what brought us to, uh, to begin adopting the technologies and the approach um, is that uh, we uh, have gone beyond our traditional uh, data sets that we've needed to put into the marketplace. Uh, uh, and still today, we have our electronic and our floor markets, and we um, follow the classic model of supplying that out to a, a vendor network um, that uh, fans out uh, all the way to the end user. Um, through their proprietary technologies. And, and that works great um, uh, uh, for um, consumers who want to retrieve their data that way. It also works great um, for uh, uh, latency sensitive data. Um, as we continue to have more uh, of a presence in, in the OTC space and having pricing information that we want to publish out, the latency topic isn't as relevant. What is more relevant is access to data, um, being able to uh, uh, support the unique qualities of each of the data sets that we have, um, flexibility, being able to incubate new data ideas, new data concepts that maybe aren't as readily supportable by the classic model. Um, and so really what, what we're looking for is flexibility as well as the need to meet the demand of our customers. Um, and we're trying to converge on that spot. Um, the cloud technology is allowing us and enabling us to do that. So it's really a convergence of activities that's brought CME Group to uh, begin embracing. Um, we feel um, that we're taking a leadership role as a global exchange in the way that we're doing that and in, in bringing um, that connectivity option to our end customers. Right, so it's helping you with transparency of your markets and, uh, and bringing that transparency to a wider audience. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Peter Hall from BG Cantor. Um, tell us something about what you're doing with uh, the cloud and uh, and what the benefits for your customers are. Sure. Well, we have a very demanding customer base, um, and it's a tough business, and they're always looking uh, and, and evaluating their costs and uh, how they receive data. And this provides a, a very fresh value proposition in that they can access the data rather easily, um, it, it, they pay for what they use, and importantly, the infrastructure that's required to take advantage of that data 
uh, is um, uh, far more reasonable on the cost front. So um, we, we decided that this is something, is an important service for our, our customers. I think um, it, 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 uh, it can reach an audience that um, in some cases has been difficult for us to get to. Um, a, a, lot of, uh, a lot of users of our data have used the uh, traditional distribution channels in, in the market data world. Um, and and uh, even there, there are pockets of, of, of users that want that sort of direct connect and, and ease of access that they may not get, that they just, it may not be available to them even within a, a firm that has lots of resources. So um, we see the, um, the opportunity to satisfy those requirements and the requirements of other groups that, that that don't have huge resources, big big networks, um, you know, the, the, the big data vendors uh, connected to the network. Uh, now they can get at this data, they can get at it very quickly, and uh, it's, it's application ready, they can readily uh, uh, get to market, and this is an important point, uh, the time to market element in this allows our customer base to, you know, um, uh, execute their plans and hopefully profit from them. Right, so it's really about serving your customers better and especially time to market. Very much so. Okay, so back to you Stefan. Exignite, what does Ex Exignite do and how have you specifically helped uh, uh, the CME Group and BG Cantor in, in realizing their, their new plans? Sure, well Exignite has been in the business of delivering data on demand for the last five years. So we started very early on. We were one of the early pioneers in this area. And so we, we went on and we built a, a, a platform that had all the attributes that you need to successfully deliver data on demand. So there's a lot of issues you have to resolve. You have to be able to scale how you're going to deliver data. You have to be able to track usage, uh, uh, define entitlements very granularly, and still do that on a very high scale. You have to be able to sell data online, to support clients online, because now you, you might be selling smaller chunks of information. So we have been successful building this platform, licensing data from different sources like CMA, and, and, and marketing this information. And then we started seeing an opportunity from uh, firms who are originators of information, like BG Kenner and CMA, who uh, uh, needed to serve their clients uh, with similar solution. So what we are doing is offering our platform as a private label solution. We call it Exignite On Demand. And we essentially take all the attributes of our own business model and we brand it using the CME brand or the BG Counter brand. We build a set of services that are unique to BG Counter or CME. Uh, targeted to their their clients with their own you know sales models support model pricing models and they're able to you know reap the benefits and bring the benefits of on-demand data delivery to their clients very quickly something that might have taken them you know, months if not years to build themselves at a much uh, greater expense so really you're an, you're an enabling technology to allow the likes of CME group BG Cantor to focus on their core business uh, deal with their customers, serve them better, not have to worry much at all about how they go about it. Exactly. Yeah. Great. Thank you, gentlemen, for your time. I think uh, the subject of market data from the cloud is going to be something that we'll be discussing for uh, certainly many months and many years ahead, and look forward to, to uh, doing that. Mm -hmm.